All right, so over the last few weeks, I've been in the market for some new pants because the pants I've been wearing to school every day, the Adidas track pants, like I really like those, they're really comfortable and stuff, but they are horrible in the winter. Like the material's too thin and the wind just cuts right through them. Like my legs today were freezing and it was less than 10 degrees, like I froze outside. So, you know, I was like, you know what? I need to get some new pants. So I decided to go online, see if I could find some affordable sweatpants. Like I wasn't trying to spend like $100 on a pair of pants, so. Eventually, I came across this brand I've never heard of before, and it's ASOS, and if you haven't heard of this brand before, I highly suggest you check them out. It's kind of like a higher-end H&M, or like more of like a Zara. That's like what my opinion is on it. Going on their site, they have some really nice stuff. They sell their own brand of clothing that's ASOS brand clothing, and then they also sell name brand clothing as well, like Nike and North Face, so highly suggest you check them out. And I decided to try out their pants, and I got three pairs of ASOS pants and then one pair of a different brand, but I don't remember what it is. I'll put links to all the pants I show you in this video in the description in case you want to check them out. But make sure to stay tuned for the rest of the video. I'll be doing a quick review on each pair of pants that I got. And then at the end of the video, I'll be trying on all four of them. So make sure to stay tuned so you can see that. And before I get into it, if you would, please leave a like on this video and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't. I'd really appreciate it. And now let's get right into it. All right, so opening the bag up, everything's going to be inside. So have a return label and then we have one pants this looks like two pairs of pants right here and here's the last pair of pants I ordered so now we're gonna start with the first pair of pants so let's get right into it so I'm gonna start with the cheapest of the four pairs of pants I ordered and these actually came as a two-pack and they are navy and gray so now I'm gonna show you all right so taking out the gray one here it is just pretty basic just gray cotton sweatpants they have the little cuffs at the bottom so that's nice and then drawstrings as you can see and then it has pocket on the right side as well as the left side and then it has one back pocket as well just in case you wanted to know and here it is these look pretty nice hopefully these are good fit hopefully these are warm in the winter but just some basic pants i think these were like 30 dollars for a two pack but i could be wrong so here's the gray pair and i'll show you the navy pair all right so here's the navy pair same pair of pants just a different color as you can see it has the cuffs little drawstrings and and they got little metal aglet as you can see so just same features same amount of pocket stuff just different colors so just nice simple sweatpants that's what i wanted so that's it for the two pack of pants now on to the other pair of asos sweatpants i ordered all right so here's the other pair of asos sweatpants i ordered in gray these ones have a little bit more design on them they have two gray lines that go down the side so it'll be easier to see once i try them on and then these also have pockets on the left and right but have no back pockets in case you wanted to know. And just drawstrings. These also have same little metal aglet thing that the other ones did, so hopefully you'll be able to see that. And then these also have the little cuffs at the bottom, so they're little jogger sweatpants, so these feel really nice. Uh, the quality on these sweatpants kind of feel like H&M, not gonna lie. That's just what it feels like, so I'm assuming they're pretty good quality, but they feel nice. Hopefully they're warm, because you know, Anything can be warmer than the Adidas track pants. Honestly, those things are horrible in the winter, so do not buy those if you live in a cold climate. Like, if you want to stay warm, don't wear Adidas track pants. But I think these are pretty good, so that's it for the ASOS pants. Now on to the last pair of pants that I ordered. All right, so here are the last pairs of pants that I ordered. So as you can see, these aren't really sweatpants. These are more like wind pants, and these aren't made by ASOS. They're made by a brand called... 6th June, which I have never heard of before, but I looked on their site after I ordered from them and they have some really nice stuff, so I would check them out too. So just going down, it has a little, little tag on it and here's what it says on the back. It's a little snap code, so if you want to add them on snap, you can. And it has like a buckle belt that's built into the pants, so that's pretty cool. So these pants do have 3M on them. They have like a little 3M flap here and then there's the same thing on the other side. And then there's also these like zipper portions that are also 3M. And then I'm assuming this line down the middle is also 3M. And then they have the little cuff at the bottom also. So they're like joggers. And then they have two pockets on the side and then two pockets on the back. I kind of wish these had zip pockets, but what can you do? These pants are actually really thin. So we'll see how these are. These kind of feel like the Urban Outfitters wind pants I have. So. I'm assuming that's what they're like, but I think these are actually really cool. They're kind of expensive though. These were the most expensive pants, but they're definitely the coolest. So I'm excited to wear these. So that's it for the quick reviews. Now I'm gonna go try them on just so you can see what they look like. So let's get right into it and that'll be the end.
All right, so that is it for today's video. Overall, I'm really happy with everything I got. I'll definitely have to order from ASOS again. They have some really good prices and really nice stuff, so make sure to check them out. I'll definitely put their link down in the bio. And hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like on this video and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't. I'm really close to 500 subscribers, so it'd be really cool if we could hit that in the next week or two. I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe to my channel. And that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.